I'd like to explain how this and you can change someone's life. So let's get straight to the point. Cancer, it's traumatic for anyone. But for young people going through major life changes, dealing with cancer can be twice as tough. I never ever thought I'd get cancer. I always thought it happened to other people, old people. You know, just keep coming back to me, you know, you have cancer. Um, you might not live till the next week. I didn't know what cancer was, but I knew it was deadly and the first thought that came to mum was, mum's gonna die. When my sister Usher was diagnosed with cancer, um, it was a very confusing experience for me. I wasn't really informed what was happening with her. Um, my parents were in the hospital a lot, I was at home a lot. When mum was diagnosed, well, I really didn't have any idea of what uh, the long-term uh, effects or changes uh, to my life uh, would be at the time. Then the realisation set in and then I guess a bit of fear came in, you know. Um, how long is this going to go on for? Um, what am I going to be like afterwards? Things like that. Things you, wouldn't, you shouldn't have to think about at 19 years old. Having to deal with you know, school and friends um, and then coming home and having to look after mum and making sure things were getting done in the household. Um, it was pretty tough. My school friends don't really get it. I mean, they do, but they don't really understand to the max what it's like to have cancer in your family. Whenever I'd bring it up, they would, the conversation would just become awkward and confusing. When mum died, uh, a lot of my friends uh, didn't know what to say. When someone dies, you know, it doesn't just last for two weeks, it lasts for a lot longer, um, well, forever, really. Canteen really helps people going through their cancer journey because everyone in Canteen has also been through a really sim similar experience. It's a really good escape to get away from cancer and yeah, mum has got cancer but it's not as big a deal when you're with your Canteen friends because they're going through the exact same thing as you are. And Canteen gave me, you know, with this new circle of friends and peers, gave me a new perspective you know, to take the positives out of your journey and try and share them along the way and um, still have, you know, time to reflect but have that support there. Canteen offers me a place where I can talk about my experiences, I can just forget about avoiding the subject, um, trying to avoid awkwardness and I can just be myself. Canteen is uh, a, a, an awesome organisation. Um, since I joined I've never looked back. The Bandana Day is uh, a special day. We all get out on the streets and we all uh, sell our bandanas proudly. It's also, I guess in a way, a celebration of our members to you know, have a bit of a talk about their experiences and share that it's okay to have cancer. It's, there's nothing wrong with you because you have a disease. You know, show you can push through it and still be a young person. The bandanas are really, it's a recognised support for Canteen and when someone's wearing a bandana, when they've bought a bandana, it shows that they're supporting young people living with cancer. Living with cancer is something that no young person should have to go through alone. Your support will help Canteen bring 12 to 24 year olds together and provide services to help them cope with their cancer experience. So please, buy and wear a bandana and show young people living with cancer that you care and that they're not alone.